Hey everyone, what's up? Two two days in a row? That is amazing, right? I just hurt myself. Amazing, right? I hate hearing myself. Shit's cringe. Alright, um... So yeah, we're playing a brand new mod that just came out today that I've been looking forward to. Um... This is the RE1 Containment mod by Aiden Watkins, the creator of the Hunter mod, and the Berry mod, and a bunch of other cool mods. Aiden specializes in RE1 mods, specifically. Aiden has, like, kind of revolutionized RE1 modding, to be honest. Um, he released the prologue, like, a month ago. But today he actually he actually released uh episode one. So now we're getting into like the meat of the mod. It's gonna be it's gonna be a few episodes. I I forget how many episodes he said. I think like three probably. But yeah, this is episode one of containment. Uh Aiden advised me to play the prologue again. I I guess it's probably updates. And I and I guess it would make sense to just put it all together. Uh Play the prologue again, and then play episode one. So we're going to do that. And also, uh, this was going to come out a few, a few days ago, but due to those Russian guys that uh, had that breakthrough with HD backgrounds, uh, now the, the, actual, the actual seamless HD project, uh, that team is now able to add HD backgrounds. So the Seamless HD Project people uh, helped Aiden out, and this mod is also Seamless HD. So it's a brand new mod by Aiden, and it's Seamless HD backgrounds. So yeah, this is uh th this this should be a treat. This is like I I think this is gonna be, I think this might be the first RE mod use seamless hd backgrounds other than like the actual game seamless hd like this is actual like it's like this is a, this is a mod with the backgrounds so that's fucking sick but yeah uh, exclamation mark mod uh you can get this right now if you want it it's on his patreon it'll it'll be free eventually but it, it's always patreon only for the first while when it gets released but if you want it now get it on his patreon it doesn't, it doesn't cost much money. I think it's like $2, $5. I forget what, what his tiers are. But yeah, anyway, enough talk. Let's do this. R1 Containment. Okay, and we'll start with the prologue first. Episode 1 is called Beyond the Depths. Oh, by the way, this is not going to be a long stream. Um, I was told by Aiden that this would take somewhere between an hour and an hour and a half. It took Big Boss, uh, Big Boss played this earlier. It took Big Boss an hour and a half. So this isn't, this isn't going to be a long stream. But uh, we will play the prologue in episode one. Down. So this is in Last of Us playthrough? Oh yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah, can't let that screen show. All right, prologue. <laughs> All right, here we go. Look at those backgrounds. Ooh, they're crispy. 
Look at them backgrounds. Yeah, seamless HD backgrounds. God, it's beautiful. What do I have? I have a things. And I and I do have, I do have debug menu. It is compatible with uh, rebirth. Uh, I'll hold on to all this. Fuck it. Man, it looks really good. Holy shit, this looks really good. Oh, there's a door. Or a shutter. come out uh, a few hours ago this just came out today this is brand new you just able to security system oh it looks so good okay that doesn't look very good that that red uh, board cable All right, that's closed off. Nice. Yes. Shutter's open, so that, that obviously freed zombies. Or whatever enemies. Yep. God, it looks so crispy. It's so crisp. Or 
your sub alerts bugged? No. I haven't had any, any subs come in. If you if you subbed or resubbed, you might need to refresh your page and then try again. That's a common thing. There we go. When you Keepo, 14 with the two months of prime. Thank you, dude. Thanks for the resub. All oh, looks great out here. Eventually, 1904. It, their first goal was to do RE1, and then two and three can come after. Oh, and by the way, these aren't the final textures. Like, there's still more ma manual e manual editing that they're going to do before the actual Seamless HD project releases. Like, once they're actually ready for it, it's going to look better. Like, this is like this is like the, the first iteration of the Seamless HD backgrounds. There's going to be further improvements. This is not the final product. The HD mod, it's not it's not released yet. Oh, th this mod? Yeah. The thing that uh Tara just posted. yet. Oh shit. So this has infinite ammo, AJ2, and it's not because I did it. It naturally has infinite ammo, or at least I think it does. Because if you look at the inventory, it it like it just says one. 
Like, it doesn't even give you an ammo gun, it just says one. So I'm guessing that means infinite. It's either infinite or a full clip. Or magazine. Whatever. I need to find Ghost. Chewing sounds are good. Agreed. That zombie's in the wall? What is up with that? That looks, that looks pretty funky. <laughs> that, that needs some work. <clears throat> Locked. Get the lap key card. Now, that is the end of the prologue, which this prologue released last month. So now we can play, like, the actual new mod, episode one, which came out today. Okay. That, is, that was the prologue. Now, episode one. What is this Discord notification? Oh, uh, okay. Uh, entertainment. Okay. Now, episode one Beyond the Depths. This is the brand new part. All right, so we're picking up where we left off. We just killed him. Or maybe not. Never mind. Oh, so he pops some shots off? Okay. See those bullet holes in the wall where Honk just let loose.
Okay, I got a first aid spray. Counts now. Broken shotgun is what it's labeled as. <laughs> That's funny. has no power. Okay. That makes sense. Operating room key. Lock from inside. Oh, that's gory. Lab key card. not align with the others. Will you push it? Okay. Oh boy. Oh, it opened this. Hidden note. Struggling to write this note from the sheer shock of what's happened. There's an accident and the T virus has been leaked. How the hell did it even happen? The automated security systems were activated and it has sealed many of the other, the other researchers. Deep inside the lab, it's too late to try and save any of them anyway. Most of them will already be infected and will become living dead within a few hours. I can't imagine a worse fate, but I suppose we deserve it. One of the remaining researchers and I are going to escape this lab and make our way to the Spencer, Spencer Mansion. That's a bad idea. We have to die. We don't want it to be in this cold, dark underground tomb. Who knows, maybe we'll actually make it back to the mansion. Then I can enjoy one last drink at the bar while listening to her play that grand piano. Moon Moonlight Sonata. No! Leon? Wait, no, that's not Leon. No, get away! That's from the, um, RE1 intro. Uh, what's his face? Fuck. I, I always forget that. Joseph? Joseph, right?
sit on the table. Oh, ink ribbons. Nice. Can't push it? No. mod is very solid so far. Very solid. Solid, my bit rate. Yay. If I can go over here. out here. Nothing. Unless. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I can open this door. Wow. Okay. You can actually go through that door. That's different. Shit. Oh, I can't go here yet. Yeah. I need the medals. I could have possibly gone down that elevator, but I was gonna, I'm, just, I'm just gonna go back the way I came. Okay. Okay, so I will be going that way. I want that red herb. Once the seamless HD project's actually done, uh, the character models will also be upscaled. Well, like right now, just backgrounds, but other things will be upscaled. 
like the character models, the, um, the, the, the inventory. Okay, it's it's killing me pretty quick. James. Oh, you got a key? Now you're going to give me a key? Oh my god, my health. What the fuck? That destroyed me. Dude, my health. <laughs> Is wrecked. I should not have, uh, I should not, ha I should not have explored <laughs> that area. Conference room. Ate some amazing pizza. Man, I, I would love to eat some amazing pizza. I eat pizza all the time, but I wouldn't, but I wouldn't call it amazing pizza. Held in place by screws. I need a screwdriver. Still, has been locked down for the last two hours and things are looking bleak. One of the keys for the facility is stored in this room, but the switch has been converted or covered up with a metal plate panel. Can't read. That's been screwed into place. If I had my tools, I could easily remove the panel and get the key. Working in the power room, doing maintenance on the power generators, but when I heard the emergency alert, I ran as fast as I could, leaving my tools and supplies behind. Working in the power room. Okay, so the, the tools are in the power room. The others want me to go back and get my toolbox, but there's no way I'm going back there. These things are starting to change. They used to be slow and stupid, but somehow they are getting faster and smarter. That sounds like Crimson Heads. If they want the key, then they can go and get it themselves. That sounds like Crimson Heads in OGRE1. 
Which is not a thing. But in this mod, I guess it is. Oh, the zombies. This zombie in this wall really bothers me. It looks really bad. <laughs> it, it just... It, it's, probably, it's probably because the upscaling isn't, like, finished. But that zombie just looks like it's, like... I don't know. Not a fan of that zombie. He said power room is where he left his tools at. have the crimson head sound. They even have the crimson head sound to them. Jesus Christ, dude. I can't use it here. Oh my God. Thanks for the nine months. Yeah, those dudes need to stay the fuck over there. Fuck those crimson heads. Yes. 
this. What is this? Lab key. See what that is? Well, I, I, I might just be imagining it. But doesn't that kind of look like a. Okay, I'm kind of reaching with this, never mind. Its face reminds me of a regenerator from RE4. But, but I'm, I'm kind of reaching with that one. It's probably not a regenerator. But it reminds me of one. That was a bit of a reach. Damn, so he... Aiden took out the entire, uh... Wait, it's still the sound effect. The, the, the sound effect was still there. I stepped on it. But uh, Aiden took out the gas thing. seems to be a morgue. No shit, Sherlock. Oh, is someone wrote in blood. Something's written on the wall in blood. He won't give it away easily, even in death. Find him, kill him, search his body. Nightmare. Oh, shit. Okay, so something's gonna have something I need on its body. Wesker stream without cheating. Ah, there it is. Lab 
P guard. This laboratory is where they performed experiments. What the fuck? Air filter. Is he gonna bust out? Strange creatures inside. that ammo yeah Aiden did amazing like this is some shit that you would see in like re2 and re3 modding you don't see re1 mods with like this kind of these kind of changes like re1 mods before this you would normally see like maybe like locks changed or different enemies but uh not, not actual like new shit at it like 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 things actually changed with the game Aiden is just done amazing with RE1 Aiden is the Camizo or Resident Evil Nemesis 30 of RE1 he is the king of RE1 filter for a gas mask. Okay, what's the last time I seen Honk? It was ups upstairs. Think it was out here? Yeah, like I I've been playing Aiden mods for like two or three years now, and the progress he's made in this time is just out in incredible. He, he gets better and better every single mod. He's like uh I would definitely say top three or top four Ari modders that are like that are like active. Um, I'd say Aiden, Rep Res Resident Evil Nemesis 30, Camizo, and then Ketu. I'm guessing this air filter is going to have like a percentage thing where it'll run out. I'm guessing. 
guessing. So, do I just use it? Or do I just need to have it in my inventory? Hey, Renata. Welcome back. I guess it's just automatically equipped. I guess so. Underground key. That's the zero zero three key for the um for the guard house. I'm, I'm, I'm so paranoid by the, so paranoid about the gas. I guess it's not killing me. Oh my god. There's even gas in here. Is this, is this mod from the same team as Mortal Knight? No. This mod is made by Aiden Watkins. Unprecedented for R1 modding. You're a madman. Aiden, like, Jesus Christ. All, R1 modding has been upgraded. Large metal tanks filled with toxic gas. Rock with the 100 bits. Thank you, Rock. Valve handle. Okay, so I need a valve handle to turn off the gas. Yeah, he, like, man, Aiden. Aiden out outdid himself in this one. He's freaking. Oh my god, these freaking uh, crimson head things. Yeah, go. 
No, they, they're definitely Crimson Heads. They even have the, the same sound effect. Or the same uh, sounds Crimson Heads make. These are Crimson Heads. Oh, oh, oh. Wait. Is poison gas blow up? No, it doesn't. Yeah, Aiden doesn't make, like, cheap, cheesy, difficult to base mods. Like, Aiden makes quality mods. You know? Which I appreciate. No panel for the power generator. There's a warning sign below it. Warning. Vibration can cause... Cave to collapse. Do not use. Hold on. Let me read that again. Vibration can cause cave to collapse. Do not use. Vibration. Oh, shotgun. <clears throat> Myself and a group of other researchers were able to escape from the laboratory and were headed to the Spencer Mansion. Fortunately, some of the group were already affected and burned. The group was overcame with panic and many broke off into smaller groups trying to escape from being eaten alive. During the panic, someone damaged the gas tanks and released toxic gas into the cave. Myself and two others wound up at a dead end in these caves, but it's too late to turn back. I can already feel the effects of the toxic gas on my body. I only wish I could have seen you one last time. Research from the laboratory. Here's they suffocated from the toxic gas. What you got? Oh, the crank. Hey, DJ. I'm good. Join this new mod from Aiden. Mod is sick. guys are fucking tanky. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave y'all alone. Oh, I'm stupid. What are those? Those are crimson heads. Death animation. Mm 
Okay, so we need to go to the mansion. I know what I missed. I know what I missed. Durka Durka. They are terrifying. Why are you backseating me? Not do that. How was that? Something else down here. Is that Lisa? Hey, Grin. That kind of sounded like Lisa. Let's take a quick bathroom break. I gotta go. I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. Oh, man. Oh, man. Let's save again. Since I do have plenty of ink ribbons. I really, I really wish I had saved the shotgun shells. I really, really wish I had saved the shotgun shells. Cause, cause this handgun ain't, ain't gonna. Yeah, no, that's a bad start. That's a bad start. Can I not get destroyed off right off the bat? That's better. That is brutal. Okay, so, well, now at least I see the objective. It's that uh, valve handle on the wall. See, I see the objective. Hunter, Hunter new sprite? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, those are, ba those are basically hunters. That uh, lower leg swipe was definitely a hunter move. Why can't I use this, goddammit? Oh, that's so annoying. I want to use this. Like I don't even have the I don't I don't even have the ammo for that. Or, or the health. That's rough. <laughs> that is rough. Well I think it's time for the Wesker special. Wesker special. Yeah, the Wesker special.
Hey, Onyx. My day? Ah, it was normal. Same old shit. The old Wesker special. Special complete. I don't know why, but this back area reminds me of something out of like Silent Hill. I, I don't know what it is, but this this back area is very Silent Hillish to me. bitch. <laughs> That's some weird death animation. I'm guessing this is pretty close to the end. Hey, Noel. Well, it's probably pretty close to the end. This is just episode one. There's like, this is a several episode mod. Probably, I'm guessing at least three episodes. Yeah, Hunk didn't have a gas mask. That's why I had to go down there alone. Oh, the, uh, Mortal Knight mod? Yeah, yeah. Mortal Knight was three episodes as well. I, th I think that's what this is gonna be like. I'm not even reading. I need to read. Okay. I probably missed vital information. I was just blabbering. I have no idea what the fuck he said. I was talking. Uh... That's right, the, uh, the, that place that says, uh, vibrations can cave, cave the area in. I'm in the, I'm in the completely wrong place. The, the vibrations area.
past that part. But I appreciate the effort. Okay, I am really worried about this. What is up with this vibration thing? Oh, man. Motherfucker. Mod's about to end here because we're about to enter the mansion, and that'll probably be like episode two. I have a hunch. is going to have several episodes. Uh, episode one just came out today, but um, it's going to be more episodes. Anything else for tonight? No, no, no. I I wasn't even going to stream today. The only reason like I streamed was to play this mod. This was going to be a day off, so uh, yeah, like I I I just got on to stream this mod. 
So uh, yeah, that the that's the mod. Uh, we we did the prologue and episode one. Uh, that was ten out of ten. That's a that's an incredible mod. That was a really 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 good mod. Uh, Aiden did amazing. I I have never seen RE one modding anywhere near as good as that. So fantastic job, Aiden. I hope you're proud of yourself because that was amazing. Um. But yeah, uh, that's going to do it. I know this is a short one, but I just, I literally just wanted to play this mod and, you know, be done with it. I didn't, I wasn't, I wasn't going to stream. If this mod didn't come out today, I wasn't going to stream. I, I literally just streamed because of this mod. So I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, I'll be back in a day or two with uh, a longer normal length stream. Yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for the subs. Thanks for the bits, the follows. And uh, yeah, I will see y'all. Uh, how long till the next one? Fuck if I know. Aiden hasn't given timetables. <laughs> Aiden hasn't given any timetables on, at least for the next one. He's he, he's probably already working on it, to be honest. But Aiden hasn't given any uh, timetables for uh, when it'll come out. It, it'll come out whenever it's ready to come out. Yeah, thanks, y'all. Uh, I'll see y'all next stream, okay? Peace.